We all know that Africa's percentage of global population is 17%. And the global, Africa's percentage of global land mass is 20%. Africa's percentage of global arable land is 65%. Africa's percentage of global renewable fresh water is 10%. And Africa's percentage of global natural resources and minerals, including renewable energy, is 30%. That's the Africa we are talking about. But Africa's percentage of global GDP is only 2.8%. Africa's percentage of global trade, just 3%. Africa's percentage of global passenger traffic is another 2.4%. Africa's percentage of global manufacturing is another 2.8%. Africa's percentage of global energy consumption, just about 3%. And finally, Africa's percentage of global food supply is just about 8%. And therefore, the discussions that we are having today, the discussions on research and innovation and digital trade will go a long way in closing these gaps and moving from the 2%, the 1% to double digit percentages. And I do believe, truly believe that the discussions that are going on here, and even together with the Secretary General, will pay dividend very, very soon. I want to congratulate Strathmore University for the, all the work that they are doing. And I am very happy to note that the AFC FTA is soon concluding the protocol on digital trade and that will be catalytic in proving the figures that I have given.